so good. I can eat another cake. First impressions of this bus. Our bus driver tried to call the hospital. It was our first time and it's definitely our last time. Hi Zenith. On to our next destination. Day 3, just checked out of our hotel. We'll be heading down to a cafe near the hotel just for a drink and some time before we catch our bus at 3. Yeah. Our initial plan was to go for a steamboat lunch but we decided to scrap that because we went over budget for the past 2 days. So instead we had a heavy breakfast at the hotel and hopefully that will last us till dinner time tonight. Yeah. And also I'm still too full from yesterday's dinner. <laughs> They have homemade coffee as well. Raisin scones. Original bird cheesecake. And a hot cappuccino. Can you believe that it's actually my first time trying a burnt cheesecake? Other than like for those homemade ones, this is the first time and I love it. It's so smooth and the fragrance is wow. It's, it's very, very nice. Good. So how we found this place was yeah, just on Google I saw this place. 200 over reviews, 5 stars, everyone said it was great. Just a little is hard to find. I just walked to the back of a uh, Avilion Hotel. Now I know why people love burnt cheese cake. Oh, the smoothness of the cheese is quite amazing. Right. It's very good. It's so good, I can eat another cake. The crust itself, it has so much flavour. <laughs> it's coming! So they gave us an espresso cup and also after it gets cooler, you can pour it over ice for different tasting notes. Yeah, the stuff here are really friendly, really nice people. If you are in Cameroon, yeah, check this out. It's yes. really good. We just came across this super huge web. So many spiders on it, it's madness, man. Oh my gosh. I still thought it was a fake thing for Halloween, but they're crawling. Heading to the bus terminal now. in the bus that day when we came yeah, and we couldn't find it so we asked the bus driver to look for it so thankful that we found it. It's so nice! Yeah. This is actually what protects our camera. Yeah, when we put it in our bags so you can take it from all the keys and any other cards everything. At night you give the river, the boat right to the river. Oh, so oh, beautiful. Very <laughs> beautiful. And there's a cave oh. there. Wow. This is Nick. Uh, Nick yeah. yeah, he's from Unity T. Yeah, so he was the one that helped us to request the driver to find the a pouch. pouch. The camera uh, pouch, yeah. And also recommended us a lot of uh, nice places, Ipoh and all around Malaysia. Good guy. Good. See you soon. <laughs> Come yeah. to camera look for me, okay? Yes, yes. This, <laughs> this shop, this shop. <laughs> Let's see number two or two, two and three. three. Front. 
first impressions of this bus. This one is called CS Trevor. It's not as clean as the Unity T1. And also, as you saw, the luggage space is very limited on this. Yeah, so if you have a choice, pick that one. But I think it's fine too. This one has like cute stuff. <laughs> oh my gosh, we just met with an accident. The bus was trying to cut the moto on the outside of it and the moto was swerving and it hit the side of the bus. Uh, I hope everyone is okay. Uh, it was quite a bad accident. He had a cut, deep cut here and he was bleeding down the sides of his face. Quite a lot of blood but I'm glad he's able to walk. Yeah, And there's a nice driver that is sending him over to the hospital now. Our bus driver tried to call the hospital, the ambulance but they didn't know where to pick up. So another guy drove him back there to the hospital. Yeah. Really thank God he was wearing his helmet. It would have been so much worse. <laughs> There was this passerby Chinese lady that tell us that it's always CS Trevor that gets into accidents. That's what she says. Just went for a little comfort break. Oh, it was so bad. <laughs> I expected to have a stop right after we come down the hill. But this is uh, maybe another hour. I think every as many people wanted to go. Yeah. And the toilet condition here is quite bad. Yeah, I saw the makeshift toilets here. Now it's about 6.10, another one and a half hour to KL Central. Hopefully the traffic will still continue to be smooth. We booked this bus because of its timing. It's supposed to depart Cameron at 3 and arrive at KL Central 6.30. And the other one from UCP was departing at 2.30 and reached at 6.30. So we thought this would be faster but I guess it's the same timing anyway. Just wanted to give it a try since no harm anyway but... Mm. Yeah but I think now we'll reach KL Central about 7.30. I don't know if we can make it for our reservation tonight. Anyway, I was thinking about the accident just now and wow, the time where we rode in Phuket, it was our first time and it's definitely our last time. Yeah. We're never gonna ride again. It brings back nightmares. So we are finally here in KL Central. Such an old school shot. Look at that stretch. Basically, order everything. 